Hey folks, Jiminy Critic back here again with a movie review for you. Today we're going to talk about the new release, Prince of Persia, The Sands of Time. Many fans looking forward to this movie coming out. Uh, it stars Jake Gyllenhaal, Ben Kingsley, Gemma Arbitron, Alfred Molina is in this movie as well. This uh, movie is based, of course, on the uh, game Prince of Persia back from the late 80s, I believe, is when the first version came out. I think this might be the second or third version of the game. Uh, the movie Prince of Persia, The Sands of Time, is brought to you by Walt Disney Pictures. It's directed by uh, Mike Newell, who also brought you Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire, and way back when, Pushing Tin, the golf movie, if you remember that particular one. Uh, anyway, this is rated PG-13 and is just shy of two hours long. Basically, uh, this is a summer popcorn movie. Now, one thing I think about the movie Prince of Persia, Sands of Time, I'm sure the fans of the game are the ones that this movie was probably made for, for them to enjoy. As far as just coming into this movie, I've never played the video game myself, so I'm not familiar with all the ins and outs if the movie is very accurate in its characterizations. Or I will say this, though. Jake Gyllenhaal did a lot of training for the physical action that takes place within this movie. He's you know, jumping from building to building and ledge to ledge and window to window and trying to get away from the bad guys. There's lots of sword play and, and you know, stuff back in the 1100 times uh, that were going on in this particular thing. So I'm going to say it's a pretty good, fun, okay, not great, probably no big Oscar nomination, certainly not the bottom of the barrel. I'm thinking that Prince of Persia is going to be about the middle of the road, fun, summer popcorn flick. I don't want to give away the ending or any special details to this movie, but you probably need to check out Prince of Persia for yourself.